Hi, I'm Chris Peacock, and this is Vikings, Season 1, Episode 6, Burial of the Dead. In the last episode, uh, the Earl, uh, or Jarl, both are apparently correct, um, attacked, well, and his men, not just him himself, attacked Ragnar and his family, killing most of the people that were not Ragnar's family and none of the people that were Ragnar's family. Um, however, they also killed their livestock and burned down their house, and Ragnar was injured. So, currently, Ragnar is recovering with Floki, and Rolo has been taken prisoner and is being tortured. So, Ragnar has issued a challenge. So, I guess we'll see if it is accepted. Hopefully it is, and hopefully Ragnar can win. We'll find out in this episode. Ragnar Lothbrook challenges you to meet him in single combat. Do you accept? He searches for your death. Does he desire to be Earl? If he kills you, would he it did, not be so? But he does now. Tell Ragnar Lothbrook I accept his challenge. Take him away. He is old. What are you frightened of? You're injured. You can't fight. You're still too weak. Perhaps that makes a sequel. That's what I was saying last episode. Come to bed. You need to rest to sleep. I'm kind of wondering right now. She was really upset about the, th uh, the daughter getting married off. I mean, I don't think she's going to sabotage anything, but I wonder how upset she'll really be when he gets killed. I'm just not sure how much she actually loves him. We haven't really had... Other than the scene where they were talking about uh, the, the sons getting killed, we haven't had that many scenes of just them for me to really have any gauge on how much they actually love each other. I must kill a man for whom I have. The utmost respect. Respect? Really? You respect Ragnar Lothbrok? Why not? He is what I used to be. I still don't like him, but I've gained a newfound respect for him. This year, promised you would kill him. Yes. Liar. I cannot feel your presence. All the owls hanging out with Ragnar, so. Our sons in here. Believe at least in them. And in yourself. Okay. I guess she does love him. I just, we hadn't had enough scenes of them together to really get any idea one way or the other. So I'm not gonna lie, even though I don't really like the Earl. Uh, his little assistant guy, I really like him even less, so if we could kill him, it can be after, it can be first, I don't care either way, but he's worse, so let's get rid of him. The Earl? Yeah, we gotta get rid of the Earl. But little assistant guy, we really gotta get rid of him. He's horrible. The combatants can choose any weapon and shield they desire. Each man has two shields. If both are broken, there can be no further replacement. Okay, I'm sure Ragnar's injury is going to come into play at some point, but early on it's looking like he's doing okay, although I did notice him start to limp there. Okay, are you allowed a replacement weapon? You can't have a replacement shield, can you have a replacement weapon? You can't have replacement weapons, okay. Come on, Ragnar! Was that it? Was that the killing blow? Lord Odin is here. Waiting to 
see which one of us he will take to his great hall. No! 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 Okay, she loved him. Kill him. Really? Kill him! Kill him! Okay, I like Rolo a lot now. He's cool. Not just because of, uh, yeah, not just because he just killed that guy, but also because he was really cool in the last couple episodes uh, with his testimony in the uh, trial and uh, not giving in to the torture. I still didn't like him the first couple episodes, but he's grown on me. Is she gonna get in trouble for that? I don't want her to, but. Hail Aragna! We're gonna have to go to war with that other guy's people now, right? Like, he was the leader of them, and we just killed him. I mean, maybe not. They might just accept giving the murderer to them for punishment. Who knows? Well, you guys probably know. You've already seen it. Um, I don't want her to get punished for that, though. So I hope we just go to war with them. Like, if it comes to it... I mean, Ragnar didn't turn in his own wife, even though she she did turn herself in, but didn't turn in his own wife for, uh, the, mur for the murder of, uh... Canuck, uh, so I hope he'll do the same there, because that was, she did that for her daughter, so, I mean, I don't even know if anything's ever going to come of that, like, that uh, that guy's people might not even care, who, who knows, <laughs> this is literally the first time I noticed he had a tattoo on his head, six episodes in. been a warrior all my life. Many years I sailed with Lord Harrison and fought battles against the Eastlanders. This guy just wants to die in battle, doesn't the he? Gods. Well, I... I am forsaken. Gift me the chance to die with honor in battle. Yeah. And join my friends in Valhalla. This summer... We shall have more ships to go west, for that is our future. When we return to England, let's take him with us. All in favor? Aye. You have already paid a heavy price for your loyalty to me. Nevertheless, I will swear, brother. Oh, we have a bit equal now, my brother. Okay. It is horrible now to look around at the blood. Who is she? She is one of the Earth's slaves. When he died, all of his slave women were asked who wants to die with him. This one agreed. Why'd you show him? Like, I understand why. I understand that that's like their custom and that she might want to do that, but I don't understand why she showed him. Why she, why he showed him. Huh. Maybe that'll get explained. Maybe it's just to educate him more on their customs. I mean, he has been interested in learning. I guess that, that would be a logical explanation. So the little assistant guy, what are they doing with his body? Just chucking it in a ditch this lady is tall 
They do kill this poor girl first, right? She doesn't have to die in the fire. Then I'll stay. What's the matter with you, priest? I don't want to watch. It's only death. You will stay or my father will hear of it. Okay, a knife. Okay. I just didn't want her to get burned to death. I ask permission to light the fire. I honestly don't care that he said no, but I'd like to know a reason. I care that he didn't say anything. <laughs> Even if it's as simple as a gender thing, I'd like to know that. Often the way the new Earl deals with the family of the old. Ragna won't kill you. They will still shun us like a bad smell. And they'll make it so we have to leave here, even though they know no one else will take us in. They won't. Not if I vouch for you. You were once married to an Earl. Would you not like to be married to another one? You plan on challenging Ragnar? At the moment, you'd probably win. What is Ragnarok? I mean, I already know, but I'm still interested. There will be three years of terrible winters and summers of black sunlight. In God's sawmill, the world serpent will come lunging from the ocean. The wolf, giant Fenrir, will break his invisible chains. <laughs> his face. The skies will open, and Soot, the fire giant, will come flaming across the bridge to destroy the gods. Thor will kill the serpent, but die from its venom. Soot will spread fire across the earth. At last, Fenrir will swallow the sun. And then a nice peaceful birds chirping. <laughs> oh, we're in England. Okay, so where did these North men come ashore? They didn't. Okay, these people have stone walls. They have people on the walls. There's a lot more Vikings this time. But at least these people have something. You accuse them of having supernatural powers. Which is why a small force of them defeated you. I merely said they fought like demons, like men possessed, with no fear of death. I have something new to show you. Who new? What new technology? Oh, that's not new technology. to defend ourselves against these heathens and barbarians. Okay, that was stupid. Not on the show's part, on the character's part, the king. Um, that was a really good episode. Um, I actually, going into this, not going into season one, but, um, I'm sorry, not going into episode one, but going into like episode two or three, um, I was expecting that fight between Ragnar and uh, Earl uh, Harrelson to happen. And I was expecting it to happen pretty much exactly how it happened. But I wasn't expecting it to happen this early. 
I was thinking maybe season finale, maybe even season two. But I was not expecting midway through season one. However, uh, I don't mind it coming early. Uh, definitely gained some newfound respect for the Earl this episode. Uh, definitely didn't gain any newfound respect for this little assistant guy, and I'm glad he's gone. As far as the Earl from the other, or was he a, was he a Jarl? Maybe he was a uh, lord. As far as him, the the person that married uh, the daughter. I guess nothing came of that because it probably would have happened before because there was a large time jump there at the end of the episode so my best guess is no one from his kingdom cared I don't know <laughs> so Rolo as I said has gained a lot more respect with me and I like him a lot more however he's also planning on at some point overthrowing Ragnar so he lost a little bit of it as well. <laughs> yeah, I still like him better than I did in the first few episodes, but not as much as I did earlier in this episode when I said I liked him a lot more. <laughs> oh well. Um, the, uh... The, yeah, the... The king of... I'm going to call him the King of England. He's not the King of England. He's the King of this area of England. But I'm going to say the King of England uh, really, really dumb move. I mean, uh, that guy was still going to go into battle. And he's the only person you have who's fought them before. <laughs> he at least knows a little bit of their tactics. I mean, you guys don't even know how to use spears properly, so... Which, again, still bothers me. I'm, I'm over it a little. No, I'm not. That was still stupid. Anyway, very good episode. Might be my favorite episode so far. It's hard to say. They've all been about equal. Like some epi some TV show, most TV shows, by six episodes in, they've had at least one dud, if not two. They've all been about equal. I would, I do think this is my favorite, but not by much. I've liked them all. Um, hopefully that continues. Hopefully it just rides this level or even higher for the entire series. Um, we'll find out next time. Hopefully you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one.